Hello friends, today we will see how to create a seamless pattern in Adobe Photoshop. Here I will fill the background with a color. We have got some rasterized shape layers here. Now I will merge all shape layers excluding the background layer. Here I will check our image size. It's 500 by 500 pixels. Now go to filter, other, offset. Here I will put the value as half of our image size. Horizontal 250 and vertical 250. Hit OK. Now I will fill up the space with some shapes. We can duplicate these shapes and place them in the gaps. Now select all. Go to the edit, define pattern, put the name of the pattern, hit OK. Now I will open a new artboard of high dimension. Go to edit, fill, select contents as pattern. Now I will select our created pattern here, hit OK. See, the artboard is filled with our created pattern and it's seamless. Now I will create a pattern from this photo. Grab the marquee tool. Here we can change the style to a fixed size. I am setting the white 200 pixels and the height 200 pixels. Now I will select a part of this photo. Copy. Create a new artboard. By default, its size will be set as per the photo size of the clipboard. Paste. Now go to the filter. Other. Offset. Here I will put the value as half of our image size, horizontal 100 and vertical 100. Hit OK. Now you will see horizontal and vertical seam lines. I will remove this line with the clone stamp tool. Now select all. Go to the edit. Define pattern. Put the name of the pattern. Hit OK. Now I will open a new artboard of high dimension. Go to edit. Fill. Select contents as pattern. Now I will select our created pattern here. Hit OK. You can see a seamless pattern here. Sometimes light difference occurred in the pattern. Let's try another pattern and we will see how to overcome this. This time we will select 300 by 300 pixels. Copy. Create a new artboard. By default, its size will be set as per the photo size of the clipboard. Paste. Now go to the filter. Other. Offset. Here I will put the value as half of our image size. Horizontal 150. And vertical 150. Hit OK. Now we will see horizontal and vertical seam lines. I will remove this line with the clone stamp tool. You can see the right side is darker than the left side. To overcome this, we need to do something. Create a duplicate layer. Uncheck the top layer. Select the bottom layer. Go to the filter. Blur. Average. It will show an average color and shade. Check the top layer. Change the mode to linear light. Go to the filter, 
other high pass now set up a value to adjust the brightness hit ok now select all go to the edit define pattern put the name of the pattern hit ok now i will open a new artboard of high dimension go to edit fill select contents as pattern now i will select our created pattern here hit ok you can see a seamless pattern here thanks for watching